Okay, we have some Valentine's Day stereotypes. Welcome, all you lonely, lovely, lovely gamers today to another Smash Bros. video. We have some Valentine's Day stereotypes in Smash, as you saw by the title and thumbnail. And so, the first one that we have today is, of course, the girl that doesn't text you back. I was actually going to main here for a little bit early on, but then I was like, you know, this character's too hard. I'm going to switch to someone else. And then I found Cloud. I was like, ooh, big sword guy. The only damage that this guy's done to me is that down tilt. Oh, and lag, apparently. Mental damage. I have a feeling Joker would be one I'd want to text back, honestly. He's a, he's a pretty good looking fella. You know, I would certainly go on a second date with him. I don't know. I don't know about the rest of you, but, uh, you know, Joker's a pretty good fella. Very, uh, slender. <laughs> What even hit me? That was so weird. I think it was down air. Not actually sure because I don't think I'm gonna be texting this guy back Especially on Valentine's Day. Now Joker in general. I think I would but this Joker. No, thank you. Too much lag for me Hi, how are you? That was a great read. I was at 170, but oh my goodness. That was a great read. Oh, no This is the classic Joker. Turn around. Oh Oh, no. Oh That might be it. Oh That was really yes, let's go that was really lucky. I don't think that we're gonna text that Joker back as fun as that was. No thanks. I'm not gonna do that again. Now Ken here is just about the complete opposite of a uh, Joker in terms of uh, you know physique and whatnot. You know, Joker a lot faster and uh, slender, whereas Ken, you know, a little bit slower, but uh, you know, I would say chunkier and uh, thicker in general. Nice, dead. Let's go. Grab the what? No! no! I didn't mean to down it! <laughs> That's okay, maybe I just knew he was gonna die and I decided to uh, go down with him, you know? CSS, please! CSS, please! <laughs> the next stereotype that we have here is, of course, Ganondorf, the disapproving father on Valentine's Day. You're not gonna wanna bring your date home late with him in the house. You know, you're not gonna wanna, you're not gonna wanna mess around with, uh, with Ganon, alright? Oh! Apparently, I'm not gonna want to mess around with him either because I suck. Oh, never mind. I'm amazing. Ah, I'm gonna kill myself. Ganon, I know you disapprove of me, but please. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> please, please, Bimbo, save me, save me, Bimbo. <laughs> The next person that we have to disapprove of, which I greatly disapprove of, is of course, uh, is, is Richter? <laughs> oh, that was clean. Come on, come back on stage, bud. Yeah, that's right. That's right. I'm gonna teabag on him. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna teabag him again. Oh! Now you might be wondering what this uh, stereotype is, and it is obviously one that is very common in high schools and sometimes colleges. Anyway, so this stereotype is the couple that never separates, all right? You know you see them in high school all the time. Hey, Brawler, honestly kind of underrated. No, what? No, <laughs> just let me play. Leave us alone. Let us be by the lockers and just not bother you. Oh, what? Oh, what is he? Is he throwing like his name says? Why does he look like Mr. Beast? I just realized that. What? Yeah. What? That is the most confusing player I've ever played against. Why would you do that? Especially for these two. Ooh. Wow. The next stereotype that we have today is the girl who brings her friends along to the date. Try again. All right, well, I'll just do that again. All right. Oh, the rollery. Well, they might have brought their friends along. It doesn't mean they, that stops it from being a fun time, right? We're not gonna get the other friends out yet just because we don't really need them, honestly. This Squirtle's moving pretty well, I'd say. <laughs> just throw out the flare bits. Yeah, I'm dead. Try again. There we go. All right, let's switch out to the Squirtle. Yeah, I'm just gonna chill here, dude. If you're just gonna chill, I'm gonna chill. That's fine. Yeah, 
Okay, <laughs> that was... Alright, we'll take an SD, I guess. I don't know what they were thinking there. Maybe they had the go, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe they were late for a date, who knows. Now the next stereotype is, of course, the kid who hands out Valentine's every year, right? Whether it's at school, whether it's at, uh, you know, church or something, I don't know, wherever you might be. This kid is there, all right? They are handing out everything. I should have just back throw it there, shouldn't I? Yep. <laughs> oh, that's okay, I'll take a bat. That was sick. Oh, what? Grab the ledge! Oh, of course he's teabagging on that. Wow, okay. And his name is John! Nice, okay, I'm at 102%. That's a lot against Fox, and, uh, you know, it's not looking great. Not gonna lie to y'all. Yo, let's go! This Donkey Kong's, uh, tag is PK Bros. That's pretty fun, actually. Why did that send me that way? That made no sense! Ah! Oh! This kid just wants to win one. Grab the ledge, Ness! No! <laughs> the kid just wants to win one. The kid just wants to give out their valentines. Why would you let them, DK? Well, I suppose that that about does it for today. <laughs> Thank you for joining me, and happy Valentine's Day. I hope you enjoyed watching, and make sure to come back next week. Don't forget to subscribe as well. Bye!